Hi, Anna. Hello, sir. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Please proceed. Hi. Okay. Stop sharing my screen. Um. Okay. So can uh can you see my screen? Yes. Okay. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum and a very good evening. My name is Diana and today I will be presenting my FYP1 research proposal defense titled Data Visualization on Pineapple Production Output Yield, supervised and monitored by Dr. Hilmi Rais. Today we will cover these topics such as the introduction, objective of the project, scope, problem statement, literature review, modeling, technology used, pre-test survey, discussion, project, contract, and timeline. First, the introduction of the project. As you know, I will be conducting data visualization project on pineapple production. The research will take place at a pineapple plantation, Agronas Sundrian Bahad. Agronas Sundrian Bahad is a small to medium enterprise that specializes in pineapple plantation located at Kampung Kapayan, Perak, with more than 10 hectares of land. Agronas Jenbahad is one of the pineapple plantations that are registered under SSM Malaysia. So why pineapple plantation? Because pineapple production makes up to 6.3% agrofood areas in Malaysia. It is also the fourth largest produce in Malaysia after durian, banana and rambutan. The chosen pineapple plantation is Agronas due to various reasons. First, Agronas Jambahad has successfully met, made headlines into various news and media and countlessly received awards for their achievements. As seen on many newspapers and online news, Agronas has become successful in their field and business. Not only that, Agronas' successor, Mohamed Faris, earned the title Agropreneur Muda and the owner of Agronas, that is, Cik Mohamad Fauzi achieved the title of Mentor Pemacu Nenas for, for Perak State by PPP and P. From this success that Agronas has achieved, it initiated my interest to study their success and efforts that contributed and influenced such outstanding outcome. So how can I study their success? Is by analyzing and studying the data collected by Agronas company since 2018 and study the effects of COVID-19 restrictions during 2021 and 2020, 2020 and 2021 towards the company's movement and activities, such as how bad the restrictions have affected the company's movement. A summary of how the project flow. So the pineapple plant plantation and agriculture of Agronas has produced and generated very stable and healthy income. Despite going through almost two years of movement restriction, it also received awards and recognition by PPP and P for their efforts. Do know that PPP and P is, stands for Perbananan Pembangunan Pertanian Negeri Perak. So using all of the data collected from Agronas, Sundan Bahad, we can conduct research to study the trends and efforts put by Agronas team that contributed to their success. So moving on to the objective of the project, first is to predict and forecast the number of pineapples produced in Argonas using the current available resources. Second is to conduct research on the pineapple product, pineapple plantation status in Malaysia and hence predict the number of pineapples produced in the future. Third and last, to visualize and study small medium enterprise plantation. The scope of the project. What will the expected outcome will be? It, that is a data visualization tool that will display all information and details regarding pineapple plantation. Second, the research a research paper based on information gathered using data visualization tool. Next area, the project will mainly focus on Agronas Jambahat at Kampung Kempayan Para Pineapple Plantation. And the sector of the project is agriculture and plantation, focusing on pineapple plantation. Problem statement. Pineapple plantation and agriculture business sector in Malaysia is one of the highest income generated in the agriculture sector in Malaysia. However, the number of agriculture companies that use or implement data visualization and analysis is less, especially for small medium-sized plantation. 
The lack of implementation of data visualization and analysis in pineapple agriculture will reduce the productivity of the business as it lacks data prediction and forecasting, as well as no monitoring of current production. For instance, Agronas successor Agrona success can further grow and expand in the industry with the help of data visualization tool that can help analyze the business performance of the plantation and calculate what initiatives that can be further improved to increase pineapple production. Moving on to the literature reviews. Based on these two authors, author Kushawaha Kusha and all and author Asido, they both validated that data visualization is slowly being used in agriculture sector, such as in Rajasthan. They mentioned that with the help of data visualization, it will certainly improve the business flow of the plantation. Next, literature from author Post et al. Friendly and Standler et al. mentioned that the data visual visualization is a common activity that an initiative to improve business performance, and it can help companies to view their current performance and resources. Therefore, it shows that constructing data visualization tool can help an organization to visualize their current assets and make future improvements. Moving on to the modeling. For the project, I've constructed a use case diagram where the characters involved at are the students, Agrona staff, and my super and the supervisor. My task will be to collect, clean the data, design and create a data visualization tool, and use the tool for the research project, including study the trends of data and do, do interpretation analysis. Agronized team will provide data and supportive additional information to ensure the project foundation requirements are acquired. The supervisor of the project, Dr. Hemi, Will approve and will approve the data and the data visualization tool that will be used for the project, and at the same time supervise the project throughout the whole period. Moving on to the technology used for the project development life cycle, I will be using implementing waterfall methodology as it is easy to manage due to its rigidity of the model. Each phase of the methodology has a specific deliverable and a review process after each phase. So to summarize, the using the real data collected from Agronas, we can conduct research to study the trends and efforts put by Agronas team that contribute to their success. The data is later cleaned, remove redundancy, and transform the manual data such as receipts or any further news uh, from the company can transform and transform the manual data into digital data that is in Excel. So the attributes collected such as hectares, types of fertilizers and amount of basic needs needed such as the sunlight exposure, water, soil and many more. Weather trends, suppliers and logistics, harvesting months and many more. And the data will be fed into the data visualization tool that is Microsoft Power BI and analyze the data that leads to agronas success. For development tools are Excel. As data are collected, clans and outliers are removed using Microsoft Excel. The data is fed into the visualization tool such as Microsoft Power BI that will be used in the project. DAX in Power BI will also be implemented to visualize important information and hidden trends in the, within the data. For the project, I've conducted a pretest survey to the public to understand their knowledge and importance of data visualization towards the industries, especially during the 21st century. A survey was conducted and blasted to the public to gather their response and knowledge knowledge uh, of the public regarding the importance and relationships of data visualization and agriculture sector. The survey received a bright response from the public as a total of 70, 71 respondents have contributed as 31 males and 40 females. More than 95% of the respondents living in urban and suburban areas Therefore, simple technology terms should be known thus, so that the respondi, respondents know and understand what they are asking from this survey. So in one of the questions, number 10, that is, are you familiar with data visualization as 
or it is, it is also used in agricultural industry. In this section, we have less than 50% of the respondents. So in one of the questions, number 10, that is, are you familiar with data visualization as or it, is, it is also used in agricultural industry? In this section, we have less than 50% of the respondents do not know that data visualization used in agriculture agricultural sector. So this shows that the public does not know the usage of data visualization tool that can bring use to the agriculture sector. Not only that, in Malaysia agriculture, the usage of technology is un technology terms is unfamiliar. Therefore, this project aims to visualize the data of the plantation so that it improves the business flow of the plantation. In this section, what do you think is the most important purpose of data visualization? The, res the respondents recognize three top choices, that is predict future actions, study data trends, and erase and ease work in presenting data. Therefore, using data visualization tool to visualize data of pineapple production, it will help to ease future predictions, study trends of the resources, and it can help to ease data presentation. This lastly, this lastly, discussion and conclusion. So this project aims on conducting a research using data visualization tool, Power BI, on the factors that contributed to, to the success of Argonas Chernobyl Hut pineapple plantation, where the data are utilized to further explore current status of the plantation and predict future outcomes that could lead better decision making. So the current status is I have determined the methodology, details, attributes, and data needed to feed into the data visualization tool. So the next step is implementation phase, development, testing, and evaluation that will be carried out during final year project two, September 2022 semester. For the lastly, my grant chart and timeline. For now, these are the activities that have been completed and will be con conducted in near time. So that is all. Thank you so much for attention. We will move to the Q&A session. The question uh, from Spoiser. Hello, hello. <laughs> okay, Diana. Uh, first of all, uh, um, who who involved as the respondents uh, for your for your survey? The survey was blast um, to the public. Um, I blasted in various groups. Means that um, all ages that can contribute that have smartphones and can access the Microsoft forms are able to access and respond to the survey. Okay. Uh, they are public. Eh? They are public people, yes. Did, did you conduct any survey uh, among, for example, the, how, how, how do we call them? Eh? The, uh, the petani, the farmers and so on. Oh, that I have not, but if you, uh, but I can do another survey later for FIP2 and implement it for the interim report FIP1. I can conduct a survey, I can blast to the farmer section to know the opinions on data visualization. Okay. Can, can you go to your objective slide on the objective? Okay, I'll reshare, share. Mm -hmm. Okay. okay. Can you see the screen, uh, sir? Oh, okay. Yeah, I think number one and number two, okay. Uh, but uh, what? Is the the third the third objective do about with your with your FYP? I'm okay uh -huh. with the visualize, but how about the study to study small medium enterprise plantation farm? Why 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 do you need to study on that? Um, because as you said, I would like to study what factors that contributed to Agorna success. So, uh, yeah, so that is the uh, <laughs> part of it. Mm. Is it, is it part of second objective? 
that that is part of the third objective. Mm. Not second one, eh? Mm, no, not second one. I, I, from from what I see, if you conduct research, then you must also include the study of small medium enterprise and so on. Ah, uh, okay, All right. Okay, I'll... You, can, uh, you can combine the study though with the under the second objective. Mm -hmm. The third one, you just focus on visualization. Eh? All right, sir. Thank you. Okay. Last thing, eh, uh, that I I'm wondering, um, what kind of data actually do do you have? Ha have you got the data, or you still waiting, or how? The data I am still waiting for from Agronas team side, as mm. I am to do another site visit there. Um, so late, but it is more professional if I go to them face to face but i am unable to do that in this near time as it is we are reaching week nine so i'll do it sooner or later after this proposal defense mm. so can uh, what what do you expect in terms of data uh, will it be uh, numerical or will it be text data i'm expecting all like for example in pineapple plantation, they use that type of fertilizer, the NPK fertilizer. So what the brand name, I want the brand name and the components of the, the, the healthy side of the inside the fertilizer, such as the potassium, calcium in, inside the fertilizer. So that is how specific that I want my data to be. Mm. Okay, maknanya there, there are factors as well, mm. eh? Yes, uh, Fertilization, mm. irrigation and whatnot, eh? Yes. Uh, okay, but, uh, yeah, lah, I, I cannot comment much because you you don't have the data yet. Mm. But uh, I think uh, same concern uh, like what Dr. Helmi mentioned earlier. Uh, you you have to get prepared for the worst lah kan, just in case mm. kalau they all don't have data. So, but I, I'm not sure how, how good are they in terms of data keeping lah. Okay. Yes. I'm afraid that they, they, they don't have anything uh, what we call recorded. Okay. Mm. So that will be troublesome for you lah. Okay. Yes, so ho hopefully you, you will get good data so that you can do the prediction and forecasting and whatnot. All right, sir. I'll right. on that. Ah, okay, that's all from me. All right, thank you. Uh, Dr. Hemi, Dr. Hemi Hassan, Dr. Hemi Rais. <laughs> you have to mention the... Uh, <laughs> the surname. The Bapa. Apa <laughs> nama Bapa? Nama <laughs> nama Bapa. Uh, sorry, uh, ni Diana. Um, yes, I'm just wondering what um, what will be the, the GUI? Eh? The GUI, since I have not comp uh, received the data, I am unable to do the, the GUI for this time i'm i'm sorry about that sir you can get the data yes sir all right <laughs> <laughs> okay that okay. is all thank you so much the next